Hello artist, today you'll be glazing your clay piece. So you're going to choose a color. There's lots of colors to choose from. I think I'm gonna start with some dark blue. Just read the color name on the top. And it's going to pretty much look like the color that you see inside. It's just going to be brighter and shinier when it's run through the kiln. So you're going to dry off your brush because you really want it to get saturated with glaze. And then you're going to paint the areas where you want it to obviously be dark blue. We're using small brushes so that it can really get into those cracks because anywhere that you do not specifically paint the glaze, it's not going to take on that color. So you have to get all of it. We want to be really careful not to get the glaze on the bottom of our pot because it will stick to the kiln shelf and it won't come off. I have to break it off with a hammer. So be really careful about that. You want to do more than one coat of glaze as well. If you just do one, it's going to be really light, almost kind of like watercolor. And we don't, we want it to be bright and beautiful. So after you've painted a coat of glaze, when it starts to dry, you see it gets sort of like that chalky look to it. So wait till it gets that way for a whole section. Then you can go back and paint over it again. It says two, but I would even say go three layers. Be careful not to get it on the bottom. Just do one color at a time. Do not wash your brush and then do a different color and then wash your brush and go back to this one. That's gonna really mix up the colors of our glazes. And it's not like paint in that when the chemicals mix, it can make funky color combinations. Not like if you mix yellow and red paint, it'll make orange, it's not like that with glaze. So just stick to one color in one area. Go back, get all those little spots you may have missed. And look, this area is all ready for a second coat, okay? Now, I just wanna demonstrate how to switch colors. So normally I would stay put and I would do two more coats over this, but I wanna demonstrate for you how to change. So when you put the cap on, make sure that you put it on so that it's tight. The glaze is super expensive, so we really don't wanna spill it. I wanna put it back gently and then really wash off our brush really well. So I'm swirling it in the water. I'm touching my brush to the bottom of the cup. I'm wiping off the extra water and then I'm gonna wipe it on the paper towel to make sure that all the color is out. I don't see any dark blue left so I know that I'm ready to use a different color. And then I can go on to a different one. So don't forget, up to three coats Make sure you get all those little cracks and really, really wash off your brush well and test it on the paper towel before you get a new color. Have fun. 